Dude. Donkey Kong Country 4. In 2007, history was made when the first Donkey Kong Country warp was made. Now, two years and four sequels later, the groundbreaking Diddy the Kong Pro will premiere on YouTube towards the end of 2009. Join me for a smashing behind the scenes look at how it was made, with interviews, outtakes, and a special sneak peek at the upcoming epic. Since 1982, Donkey Kong has been one of the most famous simian stars of all time, including Bubbles the Chimp, Grey Pape, and Leonardo DiCaprio. Donkey Kong hit success three times. The original arcade game, Rare's Donkey Kong Country, and the DKC TV show. Due to the show's gigantic popularity, a continuation of the show, re for Internet Geeks, was created exclusively for YouTube. Diddy the Conqueror has been in development since January 2008, and although progress has been made, it still remains unfinished. By the time I started this documentary the project was 60% finished. The longest serving members are Clump and Crusher, who starred in Car Savannah. Now you've got to listen to me. If that plane leaves the ground and you're not with him, you'll regret it. Maybe not today, maybe not tomorrow, but soon and for the rest of your life. The problems of three little people don't amount to a hill of beans in this crazy world. I interviewed Candy Kong, who although was not Donkey Kong's actual girlfriend, did star with Leonardo DiCaprio in Bananic. Oh, Leonardo DiCaprio is the most adorable, talented, dreamy movie star I've ever drilled over. I also interviewed Hunky Kong, who in addition to writing Diddy, had also worked on the Captain Scurvy project. Funky, what did you think about writing the script? Rewrite this, rewrite that, dude, I can't tell rewrite from re-wrong anymore! Not everything was well with the previous episodes either. Due to copyright reasons, one scene of the Captain Scurvy project had to have its music changed. Although it is too late to re-edit the episode, here's what the scene would have looked like with the original music. When we come back, we'll see gags and guest stars that were cut out, along with loopers after these sponsors. Sunday night special report, Brush with the Monkey. What do you remember about the incident? I don't know. There was, there was a dinosaur, some kind of cave. Then he hit me with a heat-seeking missile. He showed no mercy, man. Brush with the Monkey, a hot topic special report, Sunday at 8. Welcome back to the special. Let us look at material never before seen to the public. The film has been delayed several times due to different reasons. Hey, Cranky, what's all the screaming? You okay? Cranky? Cranky! My one is Mew Tusketa! So 
構ないとお前たちの命はない And Satin attacked the crew members. Luckily, a rule was able to return the favor. <gasps> Most of the gags were created by the actual cast members themselves. However, not all gags got properly filmed for the movie. It's your birthday and you want a party because it's your birthday, but you don't know where to celebrate your birthday. Why not? King Richard's Family Fun Park. See you at the castle. Big party packages with everything you need. See you at the castle. We have go karts, video games, and, and alligators to feed. I know that you are made for the road. There's nothing in here that I value more than you, except. Yo! Earl! Yeah? Thank you. Now try to keep the lights on upstairs, Earl. Yeah, you know I'm saying? No more falling asleep, alright? This is a very important movie, Earl. We got to document this, uh, what you call it? For the posterity of the universe and all that. Yeah, you know I'm saying? Yo, Earl. Earl. Wake up, Earl! I'm the king of the world! And it's to party hardy, dudes! Maple, Maple. <laughs> there were also bloopers and goofs done during the actual Temper? production. Some not even intended for camera. I am Magneto, master of chicken! Coming for sharks! Coming for sharks! <laughs> <laughs> King K. Rule, what do you think about your role in the series? A commendable performance, but hardly an award winner. You don't seem to be as funny as the other cast members. Oh, spoken like a true amateur. Where I come from, we do things with style, drama, flair. However, unknown to everybody, this would be K. Rule's last role. Hours later, he was fatally wounded during the filming of a scene. King K. Rool was ahead of his time, and he will never be forgotten. Unfortunately he did not complete all of his scenes before he died, so advanced computer technology will be used to craft his head onto a stunt double. <laughs> oh, this is delicious! Well, it's not bad, but uh, <laughs> that doesn't sound like King Karul at all. Too weak and spineless. Yes! That's not the line, DK. It's the crystal coconut is mine. Finally, 70% of the film is complete and the crew has been invited for a special screening of the rough cut of the film. Due to fears of leaking the film to the internet, I'm only allowed to show five minutes of it to you folks at home. Several people have showed up to witness the most overrated video ever made, including myself. Go bugger.